if you hit anybody, you should always stop and call right off the bat. It's an accident, it, you know, it's unintentional. But it's not an accident when you drive off. A young pregnant woman is recovering after a hit and run in Webster County this morning, and police say they believe they know who hit her and also found the car. It happened before 7 o'clock this morning in Marshfield. Police received a call about a woman in a ditch that was filled with water. Francis Lynn is in our studio after spending some time in Marshfield this afternoon. Francis, what's the latest? Well, Heather, there have been some new developments. So I spoke to Chief Doug Fannin at the Marshfield Police Department, and he said the suspect's lawyer actually called a few hours ago saying his client may have hit someone with his car and doesn't want to go to jail. When we arrive on scene, we find a female laying in the ditch, uh, complaining of, of leg injuries and back injuries. And she had a huge knot on the side of her, side of her head. And she said a vehicle uh, come up behind her and hit her. And it flung her over the vehicle onto the road, and then she rolled into the ditch. Chief Doug Fannin at the Marshfield Police Department says after they transported the victim to the hospital, officers returned to the scene to pick up debris. It was then it all began to come together. We bring that debris back to the police department, and we position it out, trying to put it together like a puzzle. And we see some serial numbers, so we run the serial numbers just off a simple Google search. The search came back to show a 2002 to 2005 Ford Explorer. And also, we found some blue paint pieces that match a vehicle that we find later on that was a 2005 Ford Explorer. And about 11 o'clock, 11.15, an officer on patrol finds this vehicle um, parked in an area in Marshfield. And we go over and bring the parts that we have, and they match. Perfectly. Officers received an unexpected call as they requested a warrant to search the vehicle. In doing that, we got a call that this a person had called in with their attorney, it stated that they might have hit somebody, and did not want to go to jail. Fannin says the suspect is male and could be facing felony charges. Basically, it's dark, it's raining, she had black clothes on, there was no sidewalk, she's walking on the edge of the road. Um, it would have been a, literally a simple accident if he'd have stopped, tried to render aid, called 911. Probably worst scenario is you would have got a ticket. Now the person is looking at felony charges. Police say rumors have been swirling around about this incident. One of them is that this was retaliation for an altercation over the weekend. But Chief Fannin says that's not true. The department will release more information tomorrow.